it says I'm live. What do I do? Well, it broadcasts that to your people, and then I think a chat will pop up. No one follows me. Should I, um, change it? Well, let me see if it's actually here. What, what's your YouTube? Danielle McMillan, I think. hear myself crunching. Does he show on your phone? Yeah. Did it say eat butt? One, huh? Did it say anything? No, I didn't see it. Oh, chat. Live chat. Chat again. It says, welcome to live chat. <laughs> chat, okay, I see it. Mm-hmm. Okay, oh, I can put a filter on myself. Why does your skin look... So oh, so you just got out of the bath. Why is it what? Your skin look, look, look like reddish. Like blotchy red. First of all, how dare you? Okay, you want me to tweet it? Yeah. This is good. Blotchy red. You don't see it on yours? Yeah, that's what I always look like. No. Glamour. Uh, dream. This is a good one. There's two viewers. I can't. Hair. Two viewers. Who else is who, who else is here besides Ed? Yeah, it's called Dream. Uh, yeah, five viewers. Until I... There's Tar Hub. I'm gonna keep eating rice cakes until there are 20 people here. I wonder if I can make this look like teeth. Like teeth? I definitely could do that. I lost a person. <laughs> <laughs> Was it me? Uh, no. John Clark is here. John Clark Van Dam. Oh yeah, this is like ASMR. Oh, I forgot this is an AMA about Ed. But there's, no, there's nobody in here yet. Well, somebody asked a question. I didn't see it. Somebody asked if you've ever tried cat food. Some of these questions... Now, I met Ed... I'm not going to answer them. I know. I met Ed when he was 19, so... I don't know everything that he did before 19. You never will, bitch. We were playing um, Overwatch with this guy, and uh, I had just had a bag of chips that I- you all that. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Edmund. The guy said oh. we were all that in a bag of chips. Like, I heard it. So I was like, all set to eat this bag of chips. And I didn't realize that we were going to then stay on the team with this guy. And then he went into voice chat. And then I was like, I really wanted to eat this bag of chips, though. But then the guy, he was, like, coughing and burping. And then I decided, if he can just cough and burp and he doesn't even care. I'm going to eat rice. I'm going to eat. That was a bag of chips. <laughs> I'm going to eat a bag of chips. Hello, Dylan Gregory. 
Oh, rice cakes are messy. Not have a lot of neck here. I'm gonna keep eating rice cakes until there's 20 people. Eleven. Greetings. I don't know if I, I'm gonna pop out of this on the phone for a second so I can retweet Ed's tweet and then I'll be right back. So I don't know what's gonna happen, but hold on. I'm back. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I retweet. That was a sneeze. I know, can you, what if that, if that was unsuccessful, I would have like just sneezed rice cake on the phone. I sneezed cheese. Um. On my own. Well, somebody asked me something about it. Oh, you can buy me. Ah, oh, I pushed it. How do I see how many people are even in the chat? I don't know, I flip. How do you. Newt flipped it around. How do I don't see it. I'm going, I'm staying at a strong 11. No, oh, back to 12. Um. Sure, I'll see. I'm also here. <laughs> I might be able to answer the question about Four Souls figures. Thank you. It is a honey and a honey nut flavor. And yesterday Peach said, is this candy? I think some people are really turned off by the rice cake eating and they have to go. Really? Mm-hmm. people want no more questions about you. The, the, all their questions have been answered by 1,000 AMAs. No, we're not supposed to have questions for us. We're questions about us. This is a honey nut rice cake. <laughs> <laughs> um, shit. You can, you can live stream tomorrow um, C-Class. Oh, yeah. We're, I'll live stream C-Class tomorrow. Oh, my God. Look at my eyes. Um... Can you guys copy and paste those questions because they did not stay on the screen for long? I can look. One was a song about... A song? A question about... Oh my, I'm a little bit sick, so excuse me. One was a question about who sang some credit song. Sing the credit songs for the end of night. We've gone through that before. Have we? I don't know who it is. But I think... Um, it was answered by, uh, it was answered by, Matthias is in here? Hmm? Matthias? It was answered by Matthias on Twitter. Oh, well, I think I've talked to this person. It's these. And just like when you, like, how you're not supposed to feed rice to birds because they'll, like, blow up. I ate like. I think that's also false. I ate like four of them yesterday and then felt so fucking full, like I was gonna explode. Are you a bird? I think I'm like a bird. And then, do you know something that I found out yesterday? I thought that when you drowned, your lungs explode. And Ed said it's not true. It can be true if you want it to be. You can put some sort of <laughs> And then he's like, people... 
it's not a great way to start a diet if you eat like all of them. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, what was I saying? Your lungs explode. Yeah, he's like, you know, they revive people after like eight minutes. And I always thought, that's why I always thought it was like, why people, <laughs> that's what, excuse me? That's why I always thought, like, when people are like, would you rather drown or burn? I was like, oh my God, like, would I rather have my lungs explode? <laughs> or burn to death? Oh my God, look at this. Oh my gosh, you guys. Hold on. I'm gonna, I gotta flip this around. Look, these are the people that make these rice cakes. Eldon, Wendell, Eldon. Harlan, and Homer L Lundberg. Mmm, organic evaporated cane syrup. All of my food is evaporated. A hundred percent of this, the electricity used to manufacture this product is offset with renewable energy. Oh my god, I didn't know I was buying this kind of crap. <laughs> you, um, what was I gonna say? How many people are in there now? Eighteen. You threw away from your, your, your <laughs> yeah, I put it, I put it on this dream thing, which is like working for my, uh, cold. People were like, uh, she's not doing the phone the right way. Uh, she's eating food and she's got this. <gasps> Who said that? Yeah, that's a bit awesome. And she's eating food loudly and there's the microphone on her phone. One of my nostrils is runny too, but I don't think you can see it because it's. Do you guys know what this rustling sound is? It's another rice cake. <laughs> They're so tasty. It's like you're not eating anything until you've eaten four and your stomach explodes. It's like nothing, nothing, boom. Nothing, nothing, boom, boom. <laughs> Another one. You guys are so awesome. I love Ed's games. Here's something you don't know. I made a game. It's called Hide the Pickle. <laughs> She also has the score. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you smart. <laughs> um <laughs> <laughs> Oh no. When you're thirty-five and of a certain voluptuous lady, you start wheezing when you laugh. <laughs> is that what it is? Huh? A voluptuous lady. <laughs> Uh, where do you live that you are having allergies? Because allergies have been horrendous here in Northern California. When is the latest day uh, you can pre-order? Oh my God, and it just disappears. When is the latest you can pre-order maybe the figures? Um, I think the figures, everything gets taken down after Halloween possibly. I'm not positive. positive though. Are they going to be sold at a later date? Um, not that I'm aware of. Maybe after they're made, possibly. The new figures is a pre-order form. Everything else in the shop is, is actually super, super limited. You should be answering this question. And they're not questions. This is, they're asking questions for me and not about me. Yeah. I want you guys to ask questions about Ed, and I want to answer them. i got to remember not to say any bad words. They say you just don't say the F word or the N word. And Tyler said don't say the R word. Farty. Yeah. And I, I'm only going to say words to, that have N, F, and R in them. <laughs> I erase cake in my hair. I'm going to get banned. What's F? <laughs> oh, I ate hair. Do you think somebody in the future... Oh, is the R word rice cake? Is going to use... Because I said that like use the ten word, times. Use the term ban as like Michael Jackson uses bad. The best and worst half. Okay. Because, you know, you're so cool, you're banned. 
Ed what? can't have any rice cake. He's Get him off there. He's eating it. <laughs> Nudie. Oh no. I just, I saw I missed the last thing. Okay, let me try to Oh my god, my brain is a little bit fuzzy. It's really my brain feels just like this filter. Okay. Newt. Come here. Come here. Okay, Ed's favorite game. His favorite game to play with me beside the pickle. <laughs> You're being a fan. <laughs> This cat's putting his balls on my Legos. <laughs> Where? <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, he's terrible. Yes. Overwatch. That's his favorite game to play with me. Um, then. Like playing Pokemon Go. Oh, he likes playing Pokemon Go with me. But that's, I mean, is that really a game? I don't know if that's really a game game. Um. He really loves to play magic because he plays that all the time. Um, what team? In Pokemon. Oh, uh, Mystic. In G O M. What's G O M? Hey, no! Stop it! Pulled all the things off the top. Nudie. Stop. No. Where are you going? Oh, okay. Um, how does Ed feel about the magic My Little Pony collaboration? I think he thought, really? Um, I said zoinks. I'll tell you what I think, but I can't say any of those words. <laughs> <laughs> Can you get away with that? <laughs> <laughs> if only I had some Robitussin, this would the stream would be lit. Oh my god, you knocked down the Statue of Liberty. That's what he thinks. About Get about freedom. Nudie cooties. Where'd this come from? Oh my god, he's destroyed a bunch of stuff. Okay. Will Bumbo have references to Ed's other games? Oh, wait. Somebody asked another question that was good. Oh, best and worst habits. Worst habit right now is he started cooking mm -hmm. his own breakfast in the morning. It's terrible. And while that is... His name is Newt, N-E-W-T, but we call him Nudie. We call Name's him... Newt <laughs> we call him Nudie Tootie Fresh and Fruity. We call him Neuter Tutor Fresh and Fruiter. <laughs> Does he wash his own? He doesn't like to get his hands wet. <laughs> Is that a critique? <laughs> are, you, are you criticizing me? Um, do, I don't, I mean, what is anime really? What was the question? Do I like anime? Define anime. Define anime. <laughs> Because it's short for animation. Edmund does fart. And I don't know if you know that he has a lot of allergies to foods. And there was this period of time where he was eating something. And I thought, oh my God. In our bedroom, if I lit a match right now, the place would burn. And is... I was eating, what I was eating was lots and lots of rice. Oh. Tons of rice, tons of sourdough bread. And, um, and eggs. Oh, That's eggs, all, yeah. Oh, those are the three meals I was having every day. Yeah, and I thought, is it safe for us to be sleeping in this room? Um, that's how farty. And then he was very offended because he went to his, uh, tummy doctor, and the tummy, and he was, like, complained about it, and the tummy doctor was like, but you're single, right? Fuck you. You're single. <laughs> Yo. He looks like Count Dracula, but short. I don't know how tall Count Dracula is, but I imagine he's... At tall. least six feet. This guy is a tiny, tiny, tiny... Dracula. <laughs> shade of brown Dracula. <laughs> and he's tell, saying I'm, you're single, right? <laughs> I'm almost fucking 40! You farty pants. And then he called him farty pants My under his breath. the biggest insult I've ever had thrown at me. <laughs> and, and... And I've been called all the words you can't say. 
um, 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 <laughs> you see the chat? I can't <laughs> no swearing as you swear. Um, okay, so, oh, the, okay, worst habit. So, he, I don't think he's using too much. Dracula's 46 inches? What does that mean? Long? I guess it's, he's a lot more Someone do the math for me. How tall is that? 46 inches? Well, I'm looking, we're looking at uh, less than four feet. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I just realized that's like 10 inches taller than Peach. <laughs> That's a one tiny Dracula. Um. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Would Ed ever want to make comics again like Thicker Than Water? I would hope so. I think that would be great. And I actually have tried to push him, push him into doing that. I would love him to do some more comics. About me. <laughs> All about me. Can this be about and if it could just be a little bit of um, me? all about me. How can I make this about me? Am I gonna be in Bumbo? <laughs> Am I Bumbo? <laughs> I think I'm Bumbo. Um. Okay, let me finish. <laughs> Edmund drawing new art. That's so funny. I don't He's fired. I don't understand it and I won't respond to it. Um what the fuck was I saying? Newt What is he doing? <laughs> he says no. He's not he says no. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I guess so. Okay, you're back. Um You guys. I've drawn, I've drawn more things than anybody's ever fucking drawn. I'm tired. You guys, don't you guys care about this making breakfast story? He makes breakfast. You're still mad? I don't think he puts... It doesn't seem like he's putting a lot of oil in it. But he's getting an oil residue on everything around there. What is... He's just playing with that. And up until he started doing this, the kitchen area was clean. I never got a greasy residue on anything. But Ed is doing that. So that's his worst habit. His best habit is he makes himself breakfast and I don't have to do anything. <laughs> nice counter balance. He's allergic to eggs, so he doesn't cook eggs anymore. I would love to eat eggs again. But I'm going to have rancid farts. I call them egg farts. And they were. And they were. How many years did it start? Well, he's 30. How old are you? 39? 39. I think about 39 years. To do what? Start making breakfast. Yeah, just about. I would say yes. I mean, I used to not eat breakfast. Yeah, he started eating breakfast with me maybe. A few years ago. Five years ago. Yes, yeah, so like before Peach. What's the most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to Ed? He does not get embarrassed easily. You can tell about the um, the tissue story. Really? Yeah, I don't care. I obviously don't embarrass easily. But that was the most. That was probably the most embarrassing thing that's happened in a while. Okay, this is this is terrible because the most embarrassing thing that he can think of or that's happened in a while is um, I caused it. Yeah, so. He, ha we were in his room, and uh, in his. Can you believe it? We were in his bedroom. <laughs> <clears throat> Newt, um, we were in his bedroom, and his mom and sister were in there too, because that's where like the I think the only computer was in his room. Um, and then he had been sick, like with a cold, so I. But nobody knew that on down on the side of his bed were like one thousand tissues from <laughs> being sick. From being sick, 
<laughs> by himself. You know how you guys do. Um, and I grabbed a bunch of these tissues and I said, wow, Ed, you're really sick <laughs> or something like that. And he was mortified. But like, I knew that his mom and sister didn't know what that was. They, didn't, he, they did. They looked at me and, they, and Jackie started giggling and she ran out of the room. And you know what? Face turned red. Shut. I would have remembered. I, I did remember. Very vividly. This was last week. <laughs> <laughs> you should also point out this was like, like when we met. Yeah, of course. Yeah, this is when we met. This was in 1999. So I embarrassed him. One thousand times. And I still have every one of those tissues. <laughs> Scrapbooking. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to sell them on eBay. All the babies I would have had. Or could have. Tarhead called you booger boy. Uh, he is in a mood and he is being sassy. A two. I do hope if we have another baby that we have a girl because I don't think I can, I don't think I can handle having a boy and a teenage boy, no way. Box of tissues is a weapon in Bumbo. I, I know, and Peach is crazy too, but There's so much awkwardness with having a, a teenage boy. Yeah, but it mellows out as you go. Like with a girl, like I think most guys hit puberty and then that's the worst, unless they're going to jail. Um, but for girls, they start having PMS and their mood swings go crazy. Oh yeah. <clears throat> so you want to be yelled at every month or you want, some, you want a boy that just goes to his room and leaves you alone for hours and hours. Hmm. <clears throat> I will be fine with whatever God blesses us with. What are we watching? It's terrible. It started out really strong and it just died. It's garbage juice. This man has a pear-shaped body. <clears throat> I love me self. It's a pear-shaped man. <laughs> a pear-shaped man with overalls. <coughs> I alienated everyone when I said I don't want a teenage boy. Or a pear-shaped man. Or pear shaped man. <laughs> <laughs> and no pear shaped and no pear shaped teenage boys. I want a man shaped pear if you know what I mean. <laughs> How did you get Rich Evans in? R N D is I missed it. Red letter media? Something something. How old are you, Galaxy Crash? <laughs> I wanna play, are you done? Nope. The boogie also sucked. Crap, fantastic. How old are you, Galaxy Crash? The only questions you've had is embarrassing story and, and, and like. Best and worst habits, that was a good one. Best and worst, that's it. How many Best and worst. Hmm? How many people are in the chat? 26. Thousand? 27. And I. 31, girlfriends, 23. Well, that could change. I was 31 when we had Peach. 23 is way too young. And it doesn't feel, when you're 23, it doesn't feel <laughs> like you're young. But then when you're 31, it feels like you're a total baby. And then when I got pregnant with Peach and I was 31, I was like, oh my God, this is crazy. I should have waited till I was 38 and like an adult. <laughs> Uh, uh, we watched Crawl last night, which is an actually highly rated movie about an alligator. I'm still surprised it was highly rated. Or a crocodile. Can you believe that exists? No, it's an alligator. It's a croc. Alligator. Killer croc is the crocodile one. I it's think. a croc. It's not a croc. It's there in America. It's an alligator. We don't have crocodiles here. They're in Florida. That's... In the United States. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
You guys. No, it's a crocodile. Look it up. They're all alligators. Alligators. Somebody look this up for me, please. Somebody, some, somebody look up crawl for me. Uh, I'm telling you, it's alligator. Florida alligator. <gasps> Florida alligator. Alligators are here. Crocodiles are over in up to Egypt, Africa. But where are crocodiles? Over there. <sighs> the place they tell people to come back to. I hate when I'm wrong. <clears throat> and I thought it was so right. It felt right, didn't it? A young woman, while attempting to save her father during a category of hurricane, finds herself trapped in a flooding house, save her life against a giant croc. Spoiler alert. It's a beaut. There's more than one. That movie wasn't scary that was just for the crawligators it was scary for the flooding, the flooding. oh my god <laughs> yeah that, that was only my only scary part um <clears throat> we haven't seen the joker movie yet but we should i've seen the font though jokerman yeah the jokerman font what's this an emoji of the font turkey of hey turkey What's that a turkey font for? A giant... A girl must save her dad against a giant turkey. We live in a society. Oh, is this about the Joker movie? The Turkey Man? Does Edmund, does Edmund sing in the shower? Turkey Man? Font. Does Edmund sing in the shower? I saw something scary. Yeah. Edmund does not sing in the shower. He sits and cries. <laughs> uh... If you want to know the difference, look at this. I know. Uh, I know. Does Edmund have a platinum gun? Uh, probably. How did Edmund get rich, Ed, rich Evans in the end is nigh? How did Edmund get rich Evans in the end is nigh? <sighs> we got, we, we, oh, we picked up the telephone <laughs> and we dialed his phone number and we said, look, rich. You son of a... You want to get rich? <laughs> well, we're the team to do it. And then Harold paid him nothing. I'm not sure what we, how we did that. I just contacted, um, what's his name? You know what Ed has always done, and it has been the, the, the key to his success? He asks for stuff. It's crazy. You wouldn't think it. But sometimes when you ask for stuff, people will say no. And other times they say yes. He puts on his big boy dick and he asks. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, I mean a band. Can't say big boy dick. <laughs> Can't say big boy dick. I put on my little girl dick. Oh, I like this. Newt is cute. I like that spelling. Newtie tootie fresh and fruity. His big boy PV. You know what's hard for me to remember? Is that one of your pointers for an up and coming <laughs> designer in any field? Yes. What was it? Ask for questions. Ask for questions. <laughs> <laughs> Give me questions now! I can't leave without the questions. That laugh almost made me fart. But I held it on because I'm healthy. Um. I was gonna say something before you so rudely interrupted me. They did it. Danielle, are you a Marvel or DC? Oh wait, no, that's for me. Am I a Marvel or DC guy? Marvel. With one exception. Is Lobo DC? Yeah. Marvel, with one exception. Oh, I was gonna say something. But honestly, I don't fucking care. Yeah. I haven't read. She, he's biting your ring. I know. I know, but it could be flint. <gasps> it's the gold. <gasps> For some reason, I keep picturing Edmund's cat as a eugenics themed Isaac boss. Don't know why. I wonder if Edmund's cat cameo is eugenics at all. There's so little we know about it. Edmund's cat cameo. Which cat is Edmund's cat? When you were an Edmund cat? What? 
like the sticker of it as a cat? <laughs> oh, that's what, what I was going to say. I get Tarhead and Worm Boy confused. Not and like, I kind of wonder if they're the same person. I thought the same thing about Crystal and Takara. I only saw the first half of that designer toys, but uh, I want them, so send them to me. <laughs> as soon as this tar head, are you Worm Boy? <laughs> tar head is Worm Boy and Katie Lovely. All the same person. I believe it. Do you have plans? Do I, wait, do you know if I have plans for a Four Souls expansion? P yes. <laughs> That's that. Once this chat drops down to 20, I can eat another ice cake. <laughs> Gillen Draggery. Are you, are we friends on Instagram? <laughs> Will we ever get End is an I DLC or a sequel, please? I don't want Ed to make any more games. <laughs> cause then he, cause then he, cause then he. I'm gonna say that they got 10 more minutes to ask questions and then we're playing Overwatch. Okay. I only saw honestly. Honestly what? <coughs> Why aren't we friends? Trying to think of something I could show. I can't reach anything. <clears throat> what was the question you were looking for in a little way? Uh, something about designer toys. Somebody's working on a designer toy. How do you feel about people sending you designer toys that they want to work on? It's a spooky one. I cloud with void of does it have anything to do with my games if it's an Isaac thing I'll take it if you just want to send me something I'll also take it a lot of the times people that send us fan made things also include a bunch of stickers or other stuff that they've done or even comics which is always fun um, this chat they need to fix this chat because it just disappears and then you don't know what the context is and it's very difficult to uh, his thing is his own idea What's the thing? The d toys. Oh. I was going to say something else and I forgot. Which of Edmund's games is your least favorite? That would be You're cool. Any I'm seeing. Um, uh, I think maybe. What? My least favorite game. Mm hmm. Like aesthetically? <laughs> Overall. I have the hardest time controlling Spewer, which is very upsetting to me. I used to not like Gish at all. I'm more fond of it now. I have a, an, an echo. I had PTSD. From development. I had ADHD. <laughs> oh, and somebody asked if I had a good day. No, I did not. I'm sick. And then we picked up Peach from school, and she was a fucking a terrible. She pulled her friend's shirt, she knocked him over, and then she decided when I wasn't gonna let her pull her friend's shirt, she grabbed his drink and then threw it on the floor inside of a place. And then I was embarrassed. Uh, Dylan Gregory has requested to follow you. Delete. Block. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, 25 people. I'm so far away from having a rice cake. Five more minutes. Um, we will do... We gotta get Peach in a good... In a good, uh when she's in a good mood for the Let's Play. You know, start yours. 
I don't think I ever found my controller. Um, oh, yeah, I mean, she had been doing good. There was a time where, I think it was last Christmas, that we went into, like, Cost Plus or something. And, uh, which is just, like, a store that has a bunch of, like, imported junk and stuff. But we were looking at ornaments, and she just took a ball ornament and threw it at the ground in it. Let's see what she did downtown. <gasps> oh! That's, yeah. Okay, before she pulled on her friend and threw his thing, she was going on her scooter downtown. We have, like, this outdoor mall. And she... Ed stopped her from rolling over this guy's, like, artwork that was on the side of on the sidewalk and he was like sitting across from it and Ed stopped her and then she just walked on it and stepped on it and stood there after I said what are you doing and that I'm was this guy's artwork yeah and that was mortifying and he's sitting there and he yeah he's just sitting there and I don't know if it's better or worse but he wasn't a professional artist but these were hand-drawn things I he know was kind of a crazy person you know I didn't young. know I know and I was like oh, do and we have to buy this like, now like, uh, he just looked at us, and I was like, I don't. Yeah. Uh, well, she didn't actually damage it, but still, it was very insulting. Here's the thing. My mom said that she's an art critic. <laughs> this was her review. I step on it. <laughs> <laughs> but, that's um, a, that's a voice. here's the thing. He probably should have been sitting by it. Yeah, he was sitting across from it, which is strange. So that was terrible. That was mortifying. It'd be depressing too because then you have people going by and like, who the fuck drew this crap? Oh. <laughs> it's this guy sitting over on the other side of the street. So that was terrible. I found a piece of rice cake. Did what, you find me? What is Edmund going as for Halloween this year? Ed is going to be Jason. What's Peach going to be? I don't know which Jason. Whichever mask I can find, I have to dig it out. Uh, Peach is going to be Dracula, and I am going to be Freddy. Chonky Freddy. <laughs> Monkey. Danielle, was Isaac dead, or is he, did he imagine it? Did who imagine it? Isaac. Did Isaac imagine that he's dead? Yeah, or is he really dead? Or is he... Right? Huh? Or is he? Yeah. Yeah. Think about that one. Did he imagine it or is I he... know! <laughs> <laughs> what is the Florida-based grocery store chain? Piggly Wiggly? Do you guys have that? Gator... Grub. Gator gooch. <laughs> That's when it's real scaly. Dank and sweaty. <laughs> it's, it's sweaty down there. In Florida. Yeah. <laughs> Publix. I don't think we have that. <laughs> when will we hear about Ed's secret project? When will I hear about it? What secret project? Response to it. <laughs> um, okay, so we've been to Walmart like a total of three times. We don't have one very close, but the first time we ever went, we had to stop in from, um, we're on like this three hour drive and we had to stop for like tape or something like that while we were moving. And we went in and there was really people greeting you there, which, um, I had only seen that on commercials, and then it was like, oh my god. We've semi-recently found out that the area of California that we live in is more... It's got its shit together, like, really well. Um, there's, like, literally no pollution here. Like, the whole, you know, the pictures of people going and cleaning up the beaches and stuff? You can't fucking... You can barely find a piece of garbage on a whole giant mile stretch of beach. Yeah. And we recently got into, well, I can't even say that we got into magnet fishing, but we tried to mag magnet fish because it sounded really cool. And we're we can't even get a fishing hook. Watching these people in the UK, like, dredge up crazy shit. Um, and it's like, okay, we'll just go find some bridge or 
up here. We'll go down to our wharf. Nothing. It is clean. A it's half so of clean. a half of a screw. Um, and what I, what I, the point I was getting at was the people of Walmart thing does not apply here because there's actually not that many, I guess, trashy, ultra poor or mentally ill people able to survive with the prices that are here. So you don't see those. That well, those people are just on the street downtown. Yes, those people are just on the street selling their art. And then little kids. Just what trashy. Ed recently saw a guy drop his bottle of vodka and it didn't break and he picked it up and said it's a good day to get drunk <laughs> well, uh, one time we saw this guy walking with a huge freezer bag of pot i thought you were gonna talk about the guy with his huge the huge balls oh yeah there was a guy with elephantitis of two guys i think so two guys with elephantitis of the testicles i think it's i think it's elephantitis elephantitis crocodile <laughs> But the best part of the one guy I think it's testicles. was that his giant bulge looked like it had a snail trail all over it at all times. I did not see that. I did. You hang out in the library. The bookstore. Library. Porters. He, yeah, that too, but the library. Oh, I never saw him at the library. I saw him when I was young in, in, high, in high school. Yep. Oh. He died cancerous testicles right now there's a guy that we see a lot and i don't know has anybody ever seen um Ma, uh manos hands of fate Manos. Some of them, there might be some people that have has anyone seen that is anybody familiar with torgo is anyone familiar with the character torgo from manos hands of fate it's a terrible movie barely watchable but pretty funny Good night, Savage Mantis. Alright, we're gonna play. Has anybody seen that fucking movie? Oh, Tar had said long ago. Do you remember the character Torgo? Do you think he's supposed to. Oh my god, I what? just got it. What? He's supposed to be like a pan guy. Is he? And that's why his legs are like that? I think so, and he has like a staff that he's walking with. Yeah, but I thought it's just his legs were all rickety. I think he's a devil pan guy senior dude. yeah oh no i'm familiar with i didn't see that i missed what you said last person I already closed my laptop to okay well this character torgo he's like three feet tall man and um there's a guy downtown that uh he looks like torgo he's a little but he's probably a lot smaller than that guy. and then you know what's amazing he was sitting in the back of togo's this morning and we're like ed we we me and myself were like ed <laughs> 46 inches tor Torgo. <laughs> um, Torgo's at Togo's. <laughs> and he could be, he could be what Jared was to Subway as. Our child raped it. High probability of that. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna go. I've been waiting to play Overwatch for 48 minutes and 35 seconds. Oh, Newt's running because he thinks he's going to get some food and he's not. Ed, or, Ed are you going to say bye? Do you guys hear him say bye? Say bye again so they may hear you. Bye again. <laughs> Good night. Uh, uh, like and subscribe and uh, check out um, Lundberg's Rice Cakes. Use the code McMillan uh, uh, 19 for a free rice cake. <laughs>